Hey, what's going on, people? Welcome back to my channel. It's Pop Migs coming at you with another unboxing video. Today's video, we're gonna unbox an order that I got through Funko Shop. So this is a huge box, and I'm super excited for it because of one specific pop that is in there. And I'm gonna tell you a little bit of a backstory of what happened with that in a second once I get it out. But I am excited for this either way. So before we get into that, make sure that if you don't already, make sure you subscribe to my page down below as well as liking and commenting on my video. And feel free to share it with your friends and family. You can stay up to date with the rest of my videos and what's going on here in Pop Migs as I keep coming out with some great content for you guys. Make sure that you go over to Instagram and check me out at pop underscore Migs so you can stay up to date with my social media platform. You can take a look at some of the posts that I've been posting recently, which is the 31 days of pop horror or horror pops, which is basically all my horror line. I'm putting up a different featured photo of a, of a pop every day, but I do put up some cool stuff on there on Instagram. I really appreciate you guys for giving me a follow there. So let's get into this box. So first things first, most of my stuff comes pretty good. This is a huge, you know, Funko package here, but the bottom of the box, which is the top, was open, but it looks like it was like ripped. I don't know if someone tried to get in here. I'm really hoping not. But if you look inside, there was also sorters. So I guess I didn't really want to get in there and get into the sorters, but they're in here. So I believe everything should be safe and sound. Luckily, I'm sure if something was loose in here, it probably would have been gone with this big of a tear, but who knows? I mean, sometimes it's just accidental. They don't even know. They're just tossing the boxes around. But with that being said, let's just pop this open here. Um, I don't know the exact amount of pops that are in here. Like I said, I know one specific one that I was trying to order that is in here. Uh, once I get it out, I'll tell you a little bit about what happened with that. So they do have, it looks like two separate boxes. Two little baby Funko Pops boxes. All right, let's get this to the side. So, See what we got in here. Oh, yeah. All right, so that's that. And then there, I think this one is should be under the crin. All right, so I'm gonna do that one second because I'm super stoked about that. Uh, let's get into this one first. So, this one has a couple sodas and some regular pops. So, horror, Halloween, October, it's that month. So, I had to make sure I keep adding to that line. I got another one here. Good old Chucky from Child's Play 2. So, that's a super, super cool, creepy one. So I do have a Chucky, which is the like pizza face one up here, which is a Child's Play 3 Walmart exclusive. And I do have Chucky on a cart, a push cart, which is also from Child's Play 2, but that's an out of box pop that I have back when I was originally uh, getting pops. So I had to make sure I got this one. This is really like one of the OG looking ones to me. Of course, the little doll, such a creepy one. He haunted me when I was a child. <laughs> He's one of those scary, Movie still to this day that's still a little sad. It's not probably not even like the best movie when you watch it back now because it was so old, but it was just so creepy to think of, you know, a doll that would come back to life and, you know, try to kill you. So there it is. I love the back. You know, it's got the poster there of him trying to cut the jack in the box and the jack in the box looks so scary. <laughs> so that's a cool one. So Chucky from Child's Play 2. Put this down. And then we got. Just good old Pennywise with a boat. So I saw that this was on Funko. So I know this has been around for a little while. They re-released it, I believe. But this is from the you know first It uh, movie, now part two. And this is just him with the boat. So I do have a few Pennywises already. However, I do have the old original uh, Pennywise in box. And then I have two out of box Pennywise pops. One is with him with the red balloon. And then the other one's him with the teeth open and he's just like growling. So I didn't have any other ones of the of the newer it penny well the newer pennywise inbox. So they did have this one. It was normal, you know, common price. So I figured I'd, I'd get on this. I wanted to get him just to have more of a display with the inbox. So I did get Pennywise with the boat, just because he's, you know, just that cool normal one. I love that character. I love both of these. I mean, two 
crazy creepy characters for sure. So with that being said, I also picked up these two Pennywise Funko sodas. So if you saw in a previous video uh, that I posted, I, I purchased for the first time my first ever Funko soda. So I'm not sure if you can actually see right up here, it's kind of a little bit off screen, but the, the Joker. So Joker, favorite character you guys all know. And when I decided, I was like, let me get into some of these sodas. I wanted to be a little specific. I just wanted to get every single soda that's out. I wanted to get the ones that I really liked and that fit into what you know I like to collect. Joker was number one, obviously. Horror is another one, so I, I love this Pennywise. So I love the front there. So this is, um, of course, like if you don't know about Funko Sodas, they are pieced by 20,000 of them. So there is a Chase variant. So 17,000, well, the Joker was one of 17,000 would be a common, and then only one of 3,000 would end up being one of the Chases. So that's why I ordered two. Same thing with this, I got two. Just hoping that I could press my luck again. So like, like I did with the Joker, I was able to pull a common and a chase. And that's what I'm hoping to do here with these uh, Pennywise. So the Pennywise, if you see in the back, there he is. So that's, of course, the newer looking Pennywise from It. And then the chase version is, oh, the chase version is super cool. So the chase version is him with that wig, like, f going over his face. So they do have that in normal pop version, which I've been really trying to get because that one was a super cool look. Uh, that is the chase version of this Pennywise. So let's see what we got. We'll pop these open. It'll be a little bit of a mystery for you guys and myself. So they do put a little cog inside just in case you don't know what the chase looks like. A little pog like card that'll tell you this is the common one of 17,000 or this is a chase, the one of 3,000. Congratulations, you know, that kind of thing. So I'll open these up and keep the pog inside because I don't want to see if it's the chase. I'm going to pop it open. Let's see. Oh, let's go. So I got him again. Oh, it's awesome. So I got the chase. Let's go. All right. Look at that. So that is so cool. So he is in his suit, and like I said, the, the, the wig hair that he had on, and it's blowing over his face. The first one I pulled, and it happens to be the chase. Hey, maybe getting two is like perfect. I would think maybe like three would be it, but oh, look at the picture. So it's cool. So it's not the normal picture. They did make it a little different. So it's him with the hair, and it says, you found the chase Pennywise with wig, one in 3,000. So it says right in the park. That is so cool. Oh, that's awesome. Super hyped for that. So let's see this. So it would be cool to get two chases. The chances of it obviously are, are a lot slimmer, but in reality, just collecting purposes, I would like to, you know, have this be the common. Ooh, this one's a little tougher to get. Some of these are a little, a little tight. Right. Let's see. Really got so I, I could tell right away with the hair. Was... All right, so this is the normal one, cool. So that's that's perfect, that's awesome. I wanted to get one of each, which is exactly what happened when I got the two jokers, and that's exactly what happened here. So here's the common, and that is him in his little suit. And then I'll just show you here. So the card is a little different, so it's just got his normal look there. And then on the back, it says Pennywise, the one in 1700. Or 17,000, sorry. Awesome. So we got Pennywise and the Pennywise Chase Soda. This one's a little tight though. Get on. So I'm gonna put these over here because I got one more pop left. So a little bit of story real quick for you guys. So this pop was announced a really long time ago. So it was actually a pop that was announced that was going to be coming out for pre-order and it was a very, a brand new line. I remember when they had like a, uh, that convention type thing, people were putting in videos of what was going to be coming out for 2020. Of course, this was all before the pandemic and everything got crazy. They had a bunch of stuff in store, what was going to be releasing, et cetera, et cetera. This was something that they had on there that was going to be releasing. It was a whole new line. So you might know what I'm talking about. This specifically was pop albums so i was obsessed with the fact that they had this set up it's so cool to have as a display where they have an album 
look, the whole box of the album, and then a small pop to kind of fit into the character picture of that album. And then of course, the fact that it was the very first one to be the Notorious B.I.G. album it was so cool with him as a baby. So I was super excited for that. So they came out with pre-orders. I pre-ordered, I want to say in February. I remember looking actually at a receipt. So it was in like February. I don't remember what time in February that I placed that order. I'm assuming because of the pandemic and everything crazy that happened, a lot of things were backed up or if I don't know if this just this specific pop just wasn't being made. Whatever happened, it I, I didn't think I was gonna get it. I don't remember getting any in information. I ordered through GameStop, pre-ordered, never got anything. So then I was on Funko's website, Funko.com, and it had it. It just was up there, and I was like, "Are you kidding me?" And it was for sale. It wasn't pre-order, so I jumped on and ordered it with all this stuff, and I was super psyched. Literally, like two days, maybe the next day. I get an email confirmation from GameStop that the pre-order for the Pop Album for SBIG was shipping and had been shipped. And I was like, what? I had no idea. Like, I completely forgot about that. So that one did ship. So I do have two of those. So one of those for sure, I believe is going to be part of, of some kind of giveaway because that was just like a super surprise and it's such a cool limited pop. I'll see. I don't know. I got to figure it out. But either way, I haven't even seen the other one because I didn't open it because I knew this one was coming in, but oh, I love this. I love the look of it. I love, like I said, I love the, the setup of how it is. I love the pop itself. I love just what they did. And of course this is, like I said, Ready to Die, the Notorious B.I.G. album. And that is the first ever pop album. So you see he's number one, so zero one as the very first one. So that's the cover of the album in the back. So Notorious B.I.G. And then you guys, him as a little baby right there in the middle and then Ready to Die says down at the bottom. But the pop is of course him as a baby. <laughs> the nice cool little fro, I love that. And I just, this, this box is beautiful. On the back, same thing. So the album cover on the back, one Ready to Die, Notorious B.I.G. And then the little picture of the pop they put down there, um, as well as, you know, on the side, like a normal pop box. But there's see-through up on top. This is basically in like a stack. So it's almost like a pop stack. So this is actually hard plastic. So it is like a, like a hard stack, but a huge <laughs> hard stack in a very specific size. And I, oh, this is so cool. I'm not even gonna touch this or open this. Still got the plastic and everything. I just love the way it looks. Perfect to be displayed like this. Tell me what you feel about this. They have. They are gonna start to release more of these. So I did do a pre-order. So they just had to put a pre-order out for the ACDC um, album. So that one is cool. So that one, I believe that one's like black and white, like a little black and gray color. So that's what the the pop also looks like. So I did play somewhere for that. So that's a pre-order. That's, I believe, not coming out until later on, maybe around December or something. So it's a little bit later. But that number on that one is 03. So I haven't done any research to find out who 02 is because I'm assuming there has to be a second album pop that's going to be coming out. I did see some rumors of the Nirvana pop coming out with the little baby that's swimming. I don't know if that was for sure or confirmed. But this one I know was the original one. And for a while, I thought it was just never going to be made. And then they finally came out with it. But I'm super psyched for this. So that was awesome. So let's take a look at this. So like I said, we got the Notorious B.I.G. Pop album. Got some more cool horror stuff, as well as two more pop sodas. Pull the chase again. Thank you so much. That was awesome. Please make sure that you guys like, comment, and subscribe to my page down below if you haven't already, so you can stay up to date with more content. Check me out on Instagram at pop underscore makes. Thank you guys so much. Like I always say, make sure you guys are staying safe out there. And until I'm back with another video, take it easy, guys.